Hey guys, sorry it's been a while, I know. Um, but um, today I'm going to be doing this look for you. It's kind of a Halloween, kind of like a mermaid tropical look in a way, even though Halloween's like already past. You can think about it for next year if you want. It's just like this pretty, you can't see it on this side because of the light. My window is on that side, so I'll show you this one. It's kind of like um a blue and a green with like a deeper colour at the end just to deepen deepen um the eye out. And we're going to be using my MAC palette. Now, this palette I got off eBay, so I have no idea if it's real. I don't think it's real just because MAC never like puts anything on there that I know. They only put the MAC sign there. But this is what it looks like. If any of you have seen this at a MAC store, can you please let me know so I know that it's like not fake. But the colours are pigmented and that's all I really care about. Okay, this mirror's going to blind you. Okay, here. Can't say the sponge tip applicator, but we don't use that. The colours look like that. And these are the true colours. I have good sunlight today. And today we're going to... Oh. Okay, yeah, this isn't working. Okay. So today we're going to be using this cream colour right here. These two. The blue one first, then the green one. And then this colour here. Just to deepen this crease up a little bit. This colour is like the oddest colour I've ever seen in my life. Let me swatch it for you. It has like... It's like black with like hints of green and gold shimmer. So, yeah, but I think it's really pretty. Let me just use that here. Just a little, and it comes up actually green if you can see. Kind of like a really deep green. So, yeah, I use that. And then for brushes, I just used these three brushes. These are pretty much the only brushes I actually have. Oops, sorry, Milana. My friend texts me saying sorry. I mean, saying thanks for not coming to school. She wasn't going to come and then I said I was coming today. But I didn't. Oops. Um, and here... I didn't come because I have been feeling really, really, really like ill and I just did this look for you guys just to take my mind off it pretty much. Bless you. That was my dog. You okay, Ellie? You okay? You come here? Come here. Come on. Come. This is Ellie. This is my dog, Ellie. She's an English stuffy and she is, I don't know, four and she's pregnant. We just, we think that she's pregnant because her stomach's messy because she's so cute. Look at her, look at her, you just want to eat her. She's so cute. She's so cute. Oh, please don't lick them. Anywho, as I was saying for like the 500th time, um, I'm getting Sigma brushes for Christmas because I was going to save up for MAC brushes, but they are so expensive and Sigma brushes are pretty much the dupe for MAC brushes. Like, even better. So, who you guys enjoy this look this is what it looks like again sorry I was a bit out of camera there you can't really see it on this side oh yes you can there you go no actually it's worse okay so we'll get to it first we're going to start off with um, a primer but I don't actually have a primer so if any of you guys recommend one just leave a comment down below so we're just going to start off with the base. I'm using this cream colour right here. Just going to put that all over the lid. Mainly focusing the um, eyeshadow on the inner corner. Then what we're going to do next so we're going to use a different eyeshadow brush this time and we're going to pick up 
this kind of blue right here. We're just gonna put that. Let me fix my mirror. Off. We're just gonna put that mostly here. Put it on the inner half. Once you've done that, just flip your brush over. And we're going to pick up this green that was that's on top of the blue. And then just place it on the outer half. bringing it just on the brow bone. Then what we're going to do is we're going to grab a different brush and then we're going to grab this colour right here. It looks kind of brown but it's actually, it has like hints of um, hints of gold and um, green in it. We're just going to um, use that to just um, deepen the crease. And just dip it in the brush a few times. Tap off the excess. I'm gonna do a V. I'm gonna grab the brush that we used to put on the green and the blue, just clean it off with a paper towel. I'm just going to blend that. And also bring this one just on the brow bone also. Okay, then what we're going to do is we're going to take the first brush that we used just to put um, the base colour on. It just has cream on it, which doesn't really matter anyway because it hardly even shows up. We're going to take um, that blue and then put it on the bottom then we're going to take the green and put that right next to the blue then we're going to get the brush that we used to put the um, blacky goldy greeny colour on and just do a few lines here where the eyeshadows meet and then blend that out. This side it looks darker than this side because my window is there and then there's like no natural light over there. So that's why. And then I'm just going to grab that first cream colour that we used and just place it on the inner corner again because it disappeared somewhere. Alright so this is what it should look like so far. And then it's time for eyeliner. No, sorry. Then it's time for mascara now. Um, I'm using L'Oreal Paris Telescopic Explosion. And it's the one with the ball. I love what this does for my lashes. It makes them, oh my god, so long. Tilt your head back. Now look how long my lashes are. Now I'm going to use eyeliner. This is the best eyeliner. Cheaper eyeliner that I've ever tried. MAC is the best eyeliner that I've ever tried. This is a cheap option. It's the Avon U01 Black Neo. It's pretty good. Just going to put that on the waterline. Not on the my Jesus. Hold on. Put it on silent. Okay, it's loud. Just put that on the waterline. Don't put it on the inner corner there. So that's the look that we did. Anyway, guys, that is all for today, and I hope you enjoyed this look. Bye!